as an evening thing. Thank you. Coming to Burke was the best decision of my entire life. Uh, before coming to Burke, I went to Sidwell from pre-K through fifth grade, and after seven years, I was ready for a different kind of community. So I asked my wonderful parents, who are here, if I could come to Burke. And they said yes. When they walked me to school for my first day of sixth grade in September of 2014, I'll be honest, I was petrified. I knew no one except my sister, but she was a junior at the time, so I legally wasn't allowed to talk to her. The first teacher I met was Sonisha, and after talking to her for just a few minutes, my fears were allayed. She taught me in a class of three other students that I'm now lucky enough to consider some of my best friends. This is in a class that we boisterously and proudly knew as Spanish 6 with advanced topics. I think since coming to Burke, I've improved in every facet of my life, and I really have the school to thank for that. And I say all this not to be a braggart, but to <laughs> educate you on the opportunities that um, the school's afforded me. Uh, I've gotten to inform school policy and culture. Uh, in seventh grade, the school asked me to be on a committee of all teachers and speak to the entire faculty and staff about the progress of the iPad program, which now every grade will have. Um, I was also been on two hiring committees, one for the Dean of Students, and on those, we got the opportunity to meet with candidates, interview them, talk to them about what we want Burke to be like, and um, we ended up hiring people that were really excellent for those positions. I've also been in student government for three years, as a sixth grade representative, as a ninth grade representative, and now as one of the co-presidents of the student body as a junior with my friend April. I've improved a lot musically, being one of my passions. I've learned three new instruments since coming to Burke. I've been in bands for five years that have played in venues including Blues Alley. And I've also been in a jazz trio with two teachers that have performed in venues like Twins Jazz. Uh, in the theater department at Burke, I played Mom, um, I played Bill in Burke's production of Mama Mia last year. I've also tutored science here for freshmen, and I've experienced a lot of new challenges and learned new things. Um, I was on the chess team for a few years, and I hadn't really played chess before that, but we went to a tournament, and Burke to took home the first place trophy, which was really, really cool. It's in that display case over there. <laughs> also, I was on the uh, golf team for two years, which I had never done before, and that was incredibly challenging, and it's much harder than it looks and it is a sport. Um, yeah, I've made a ton of friends since coming to Burke, and a lot of them are here today, here and around you. They're giving you tours, they're performing, and they're here on a Saturday because they're super passionate about their school, and they really don't have to be there. They, they want to be here every day, but also right now, because they want you to see what a wonderful place this is, and we hope that you can become part of our community as well. Um, I used to dread going to school, but now I really like it, and weekends seem kind of boring in comparison. Burke's curriculum and environment for me has been both rigorous and challenging, but all of that is part of the fun and why I love coming here so much. When I was in seventh grade, Julia, my math teacher, asked the class why x to the power of zero equals one, and I had no idea. So I was like, well, Julia, why does it? And she said, you figure it out and tell me. I didn't like that because I didn't know when she was the teacher, so she was supposed to like, teach me, but she wouldn't. And I didn't realize at the time that what she was doing was giving me the agency and responsibility over my own education, my own learning, my own success, that was much more valuable than that lesson, which I did figure out and then bring back to her. Uh, Burke's faculty pushes us in many different ways, and I've had dozens of different teachers here, so I really know that. And they're here for us in, all the time during free periods and lunch, before and after school, and there have even been teachers who have schlepped all the way to Arena Stage, which is pretty far from here, just to see me perform in shows, and they've been really, really supportive throughout my many years, and that's true for all my peers as well. In 10th grade, I blabbered and babbled so much about Black Mirror, which, as you know, is the best show ever made. Um, Sarah, my English teacher, did not shut me down. Rather, she said, how about if you love it so much, you come teach a lesson to the rest of the class about it? So I did. Uh, we watched the episode, or at least the school appropriate parts, and uh, we talked about its motifs and its messages and its symbolism and its meaning and how it connected to 1984, which was the book we were reading at the time. There are tons of examples like that. Overall, um, Burke has been the best years of my life, and I'm so glad I came here. Um, high school can be really, really challenging, as I'm sure some of your students know, and if they don't know it now, it will be. But coming to Burke, <laughs> Having a warm and welcoming and loving and supportive place to come to every morning makes it a whole lot easier. 
Thank you so much.